when I was young, you could not tell me that I was not going to be the next big rapper. So <laughs> I've always done it. Um, it wasn't like an inspiration thing. It's just something that my family has always done. So it came very, very natural to me. I wanted to do something big, something grand. So I'm not sure that pursuing music has shaped or changed my perception. Like I feel like life has kind of come to me. Uh, in the way that I always dreamed. So I'm like a huge believer in that, you know, what you think and where you put your thoughts, like it comes to you. Because there's no way I should be from Anderson, Indiana, doing all the amazing things I'm doing now. So I definitely credit just, you know, great parents and a very vivid imagination for all these things happening for me. I feel like people overthink and try to overplan and try to just overdo everything instead of just simply jumping off the cliff and doing it. I always jokingly call myself a professional cliff jumper. I figure it out on the way down and it's worked for me so far so just do it. It's like the motto of life. I believe that following your goals and actually acting on those gifts that God gives you is an honor within itself. Like he didn't plant certain things in us to just sit on and talk about like, oh, I wish I could do this or I would try, but I don't know. Like that's not honoring a gift at all. And I believe if you don't honor it, he'll take it away from you. So just simply putting myself out there, trying to not be afraid of failure. Uh, nobody likes failure, but you know, you gotta try. So. Every day I try to do at least one thing that honors the gift that God gave me and I hope that I inspire other people to do the same. And what do you speak?